It's not just the physical injuries. You have to learn to cope with that. It's the sheer waste and the stench of alcohol that stays with you. I'm just ringing to um, inform you that your daughter Lucy has been involved in a car accident. You'll need to come down. This is probably a bit of hurting. I can smash it all, Lucy. <laughs> This is uh, the driver. Oh, that looks very messy. Okay, you can't go near the moment, mate. I've got to go in. <laughs> you want to come with us? What's the check two percent? She's okay, man. The left leg has been damaged quite severely. And there's a possibility that she may lose that leg. Oh. We'll also scan her head to look at whether there's any head injury as well. They drink too much Lucy. and then they drive. They smash up their cars and the people they're supposed to care about. And if they survive, they're the ones that have to live with that. And that's the real tragedy. If you drink, then drive. You're a bloody idiot. Madam, I just observe you driving a motor vehicle. I need you to undergo a preliminary breath test into a prescribed is that device. Really necessary? I... Yes, it is, madam. If you like to blunt in one long continuous breath until I tell you to stop. Okay. Look, I really, I've hardly had any drinks tonight. Probably only had. Well, madam, the test two. indicates that you have alcohol in your blood. I now require you to accompany me to a police station for no, the purposes of a breath test. No, can't be right. You don't understand. Are you I'm telling you, you I didn't have any more than two drinks. Give it, it to, to her again. Of hours ago. Please, if you refuse to accompany us to a police station, it'll be up to $2,000 fine and two years loss of license. That's mandatory. I'm going to look after my mother. If I don't have a car, I won't be able to do that. See him? He's only a little bit injured. See? Only a little bit of grief. And her, she's only a little bit dead. But I was only a little bit over. Princess Paul's one of five in a row. Yeah, well, that's a good reason to back against it, mate. Uh, a couple of mysteries, I reckon. Hey, you and two facts. Cheers. What you do on the weekend? I was thinking of going down and catch a bit of the fish. He's past. No way, mate. He should stay in the team. He's having a rough trot now. He'll be fine. So clutch him out, clutch him out. What are you going to do with those? I'm going home, mate. Well, I've been driven with a pub in years. Yeah? Yeah. Ring the missus to pick me up. <laughs> Ring her now. <laughs> Call a cab? No, I'm just around the corner. Gotta go, mate. See you. You up it in? Walking. Hey, walking. That's a boy coming. <laughs> the National Racing Service is more time. Did you do that? Where have you been, number five, since Tarza? Wait, Forest car. Here, here. Second to be number one. <laughs> Stand on the back line. Take the hat off. Don't ask for cigarettes. You'll get them later. Okay, cuffs off. Listen in. When you hear your name called, I want your date of birth. Paul Oakley. 10771. Five years with a three year minimum. Joe McGuinness. Uh, Second 68. Sentence 12 months. Scott Shoebridge. 27972. Okay, watch with this prison. If you have any concerns about your safety, see one of the staff members and we'll deal with it. Thanks for your help, mate. Mm. Yeah, hang on. I'll just get Dad. Oh, booze bass, eh? Yeah. Oh, it's a bit early, isn't it? All right, All right Billy. Yeah, thanks for the tip off. <laughs> it's down the road in Linden Street. <laughs> oh, I thought we were supposed to get a warning. Oh. We just did, mate. Right, I'm off. Thanks for your help, mate. Go on, one more's not going to kill you. Hey, I'm still capable of driving. How about you? I've been driving home a long time, mate, and nothing's happened to me yet. I've got to go. See if else. You wrote that? Yeah, no worries. Maybe I should have passed that last beer. Yeah, I was stuffed I was looking in all those bloody mouths. Yeah, um, Billy reckons you ought to cut across the highway at Ferguson's Road. Did he? Hey, Ted. Is that Billy's car down there? Nah, no way. Bloody funny if he did get caught, though. <laughs> <laughs> Ah! 
Good day. Mm. Oh, thanks. Yeah. All right, Paul. Hey, no, no, he was just here. If he's. Yeah, right, eh? Drink up. Here you go, darling. There's another beer. See you later. I'll see you. Um, Brett, you've had a few, man, so maybe I should drive, huh? What do you reckon? No, I'm all right. Nice. No. Look, man, I'll drive. Here. Yeah. Get in the car. Whoa. You shouldn't be driving. No, it's OK. Hey, Joey. Come on. Watch this. Hey, hey, cut it out. <laughs> pull over, pull over <laughs> now. Oh, please. <laughs> He's been involved in an accident last night. And I'm sorry that he died. Don't tell me that. Don't tell me that. Please don't tell Listen, me that. Please, I'm sorry. On, I'm really sit. sorry. Come, Come and sit down on the oh, couch. Yeah. Let's go and sit down. Oh. Mummy, what's wrong? insisted on driving and I'm now sorry. they're dead and you've got to live with it if you drink then drive you're a bloody idiot you all right i'm fine john i didn't mean it i really thought it would be better if i just drove you home just shut up okay you told me you were fine i said i'd get a friggin taxi I'm just going to do the blood alcohol test now, okay? Everyone has a done. Is it really it's necessary? Just, just, just to test the blood alcohol. Well, the director of emergency has requested a blood test. Can't this be done? So we have to take a blood alcohol. It can't be done tomorrow. Well, it's not much point. Well, uh, do you really have to take my blood? Well, we... we can't you take my word for it? I wasn't drunk. Well, we can't I take your word I swear to God, I wasn't every, drinking... Every driver who comes in here will say they weren't drunk. I mean, the blood test will show it one way or the other. If you weren't drunk, the blood test will be okay. It's not a problem if you weren't drunk. If requested, the law requires you to provide blood alcohol. Yeah, up, okay. Um, uh, I know, I just take you. I just gotta think a minute. Um, okay. Do you want me to do this now? Well, we have to do it, so we might as well do it now and get done, done with. Keep your arms still now. Right. What happens is we take three samples one is for you, one is for the police, and one. Oh stays at the hospital but if so, someone comes to hospital after an accident we do it it doesn't really matter what what the injuries are okay john well look unfortunately the passenger from the other vehicle has died and oh john just at this stage i just have to give you an official caution you're not obliged to say or anything or anything you say or do may be recorded and given the evidence do you understand that john <laughs> he's gonna go with the money this year and i'm blind What's Lucy up to, eh? So hard to handle, you know. Well, come to Mother's group. Yes, I will. Right, see you on Thursday. It was not a great chef. <laughs> Barb thought it was bloody criminal. 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 Poor kid, she still hasn't forgiven me. 
Even a few drinks can impede your driving. Only a little bit over? You bloody idiot. Shoot off. Buying them, you know. Excuse me, are you the driver? No, it's still no response. The kid's dead, let's look after the dead. You're going to miss Aiden's first birthday? And Trent's? Trent, mate. What about the parole? You did plead guilty. I mean, surely they can see you're not a criminal. <laughs> Try not to think about it. <laughs> It'll be over before you even know it. <laughs> we'll have a whole new life. Oh, family. You're a daddy. Oh, God. Talk to me. What's your first name? Oh, she's oh, she's so she's she's just keep looking straight ahead there. She was not. There's no dad. There's no way I could have been that scared. Well, I'll never see her again. Did we get going? Yeah. Never hear yeah. her voice. Happy birthday, Dad. Thanks, for that. No worries. Hear her laugh. Take care of my baby girl. I will. I'll never see her get married. Sure you don't want me to drive? I'm all right. I've only had a few. Besides, been eating your mum's food all day. <laughs> Cuddle her children. She was here. Where is she? I'll never hear her call me dad. And I'll never forget having to choose a coffin. For my beautiful baby. Mm -hmm. 